hello everyone it's me JP from Unique tutorials today in this video I'll show you how to download and install cumulative updates without using update option of settings in Windows so without further delay let's begin so firstly let me open uh, settings and now under the system option you can see on the right side Windows update so let me click on it now you can see here I have one cumulative update preview updates with respective number that is the build number of this cumulative updates right so you can see here download and install so here I'm not gonna click on this download and install so here what I'm gonna do is just open any web browser and just visit to this website link I'll be providing this website link too in the video description so you can click there and visit to this website link and now you can see on the right side already written cumulative update right so right now I'm using a Windows 11 so what I will do is I'll just add a Windows 11 here along with the cumulative updates right and after that click on source now it will show all the cumulative updates available for my respective windows 11 operating system so right now you can see on the first list cumulative update preview windows 11 so with the build number so if you're not sure which build number cumulative updates available for your respective windows computer then just go back to the settings and just match with this cumulative update so you can match the name also by comparing both the names so you can see here similar name is available or not you can see so the bill number is KB5029332 so you can see here KB5029332 so this is the cumulative update which I need to download and install so firstly confirm and after that you can see here download option just click on it now you can see here one download option with the blue color and just click on it to download this cumulative updates on your raspberry computer so i've already downloaded this file so i'm not gonna do it again so you can just click on it and download it if you have not downloaded it before and after that just double left click on this community update file now it will start preparing for installation so you need to wait for some minutes depending upon how big the cumulative update is for your respective windows computer so have patience until the complete installation is done so now just click on yes So finally you can see the installations for the cumulative updates has been completed successfully. Now you need to click on restart and after restarting we'll check if it has really installed the cumulative updates or not. We'll make a confirmation after doing a restart. So we'll click on restart now. So finally we have restarted our Windows computer. Now let us open back the settings and let us go to the Windows update again. And now if you're still seeing this update don't worry if you see this update again you can just click on this check for updates then this will go away but right now i'll just close it and we'll check this update history now you can see here update for windows so you can see here this is the cumulative update so you can see here 5029332 so if you're still confused whether it's successfully installed or not then you can just click on this check for updates and we'll check if it shows up again or not so finally you can see here you are up to date so there is no more any updates no more any cumulative updates also so by using this method you can easily download and install cumulative updates without using update option of settings in windows computer very easily so if you never known about the school tricks then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching